Hi everyone! Welcome to Linda's Thrifty Lives. I am popping on today to say hi and um, to let you know that things are going okay in my world. Um, last I left you, I was about to take mom to um, get her dentures, her first um, step towards getting new dentures. Well, she woke up Wednesday morning unable to get out of the bed. She called me she had um, she has gout and her foot has had swollen and she was in such pain. So I ended up taking care of her all day. She spent most of the day in bed, which if you knew my mom, you would know that is not something she does. She just doesn't go back to bed unless she is really sick. So I think she might have had a little fever. And um, I was able to get her out to the living room later in the afternoon. I did call the doctor. They prescribed some prednisone, and she took that, a couple of tablets of that, but she has such bad side effects from any steroids that she didn't continue it. But she's doing well and able to walk. But it was a long day, and I was really worried, you know. So, <clears throat> you know, but anyway. So when I called to cancel the appointment, the next appointment they have is in two weeks. So... You know, it just is what it is. So our next appointment for dentures now is April 9th. So we will continue to eat soft foods for a, f a few more weeks. So, But um, the other day when I was out, I went by Hobby Lobby to get um, some of these, what do they call them, S storage bags. They're by... Um, a memory keeper is what they call them and um, they're a Hobby Lobby product not a memory keeper product and these are 13 by 13 so you can put 12 by 12 paper in them and a friend of mine um, Janae had said she was using them to like combine paper stickers washi tape, anything that was a, a collection, and I thought, what a good idea, because if I put it away, I'll never remember what I have of a whole collection. So they were um, all, um, oh gosh, what do you call it? Anyway, all of the Hobby Lobby brand paper studio um, items were 50% um, off. So this doesn't say... Um, Paper Studio anywhere on it, but if you go on the website, it shows it as, as half price. Same SKU number and everything. So I had it on my phone, and I showed it to them, and they gave it to me for half price. It's normally $12.99. So they did not want to. This one lady did not want to do that, but she did. So um, they come with, I think there's a dozen of them. How many in here? Ten. There's ten in here, and they are just great. And I started using one to to keep um, my paper for my collage too. It's just a really good way to store some stuff. So I was really glad I picked those up. I'd like another package of them, but I don't know if I want to go through the hassle of trying to get them to give it to me half price when it's on sale. And I also picked up. They had a few um, pads in their um, art section that were on clearance, 75% off. So I got this 8x8 watercolor pad, and it's Master's Touch, which is <clears throat> Hobby Lobby's brand. And this is normally $5.99, so it was $1.49. And I have several of um, Master's Touch um, watercolor pads, but I really like this 8x8. You can use it for a lot of things to make cards and stuff. So I got that one because that price was so good. <clears> then <throat> this was the only one they had of the Canson Mixed Media. And this one is a 7x10. It's normally, let me look at the price. It's normally like $13.00. And it was $3.17. That is awesome. And it's got 50 pages in it. And I like it because it's got the bigger pages to do some collage in or some mixed media. And then they even had a bigger one, which I was like, what? 
So this is a 9 by 12 and it was $15.99 marked down to $4.07. So I was really excited. Um, they didn't have a lot of, um, a lot of the little bins were empty. And this was the last one of this size, because this is awesome. And uh, that's such a good price for them. I had bought one on Amazon not long ago, and I paid, I don't know, $5 or $6 for it. And I thought, that was good. <clears throat> but that was really good. So... While I was out, I also ran by a thrift shop looking for some magazines because I don't have any magazines and I want to start collecting some um, pages to do some collage work. I couldn't find a single magazine and I don't know who carries them now. I've been to two thrift stores and neither one of them had magazines. So I will try a couple more in my town when I'm out and about. But I did find this book. Isn't this beautiful? Now wait till I take off the paper cover. I am going to use this to make a journal. Look at this. Is that not gorgeous? Oh my goodness. I don't know if you're familiar with Lily. I think her name is Pulitzer. Pulitzer? Pulitzer? Um, but she's an artist and a designer. And she is the queen of pink and green, and she makes fabrics and clothes. And so this book is about um, a lifestyle kind of thing. And it has all sorts of photographs in it that can be used. And it has bunches of these watercolors. Isn't that fun? So I am going to turn this into... Um, some sort of glue book. Some girly, girly glue book. I'm so excited. And it was one dollar at the thrift store. So, yes. Um, <clears throat> and then I got some friend mail. It was totally unexpected from Rosemary, from Rosemary's You Rock Art. I was just like, what? It was so exciting. So let me show you the card. <clears throat> So cute. Happy Easter. Look at that. That is adorable, Rosemary. I love it. I think, oh, all of the little eggs are on there. How cute. And that bunny rabbit. Okay, it says, Hi, Linda. I bought this flamingo keychain and wanted to make a tassel with it just for you. Sending love and hugs. You rock. Love, Rosemary. Oh, Rosemary, how sweet. So, I haven't looked yet. I'm so excited. Ding, 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 ding. <gasps> Look how cute. Oh, <laughs> so cute. Look at the flamingo. And then look at the tassel. Oh, I love it. It's all this variegated yarn. And then this eyelash. And a big pink bow. Oh, Rosemary, this is adorable. Honey, I will use this. I'm, a, I'm kind of afraid to put my keys on it because it will get <laughs> messed up in my purse. But I love it. I, oh my gosh, that is so cute. If you don't know Rosemary, you should go visit her channel. I'll leave her below. She is so talented. She's a crafter. She um, is a musician. She's a cook. She just, her channel is so great. And she does lots of hauls, Dollar Tree, and other places. And her personality is just wonderful. She's just fun and happy and loving. And I, I love Rosemary. She's been one of my... Um, favorite people on YouTube for a very long time, but look at that. That is adorable. Thank you so much. And so there's some else in here. Ooh, cute little pink envelope. Oh, perfect. Let's see. Hi, Linda. I didn't make the dimensional flowers. I found them at a thrift store and I wanted to share. Oh, how great. Look at that. I love that little mermaid pad of paper. So look at all of these. Okay, so these are some... Oh, look how cute these flowers are. 
she sent a bunch of stuff. Oh, I like this. Think positive. Thank you for sharing these with me. So pretty. Look at this one. Challenge yourself. I love it. And then there's some butterflies and some other flowers. <laughs> Look at this little girl. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. See, all these things will be going in my collage and my, and my mixed media. Green apple. Oh, these are pretty. She does know I love my pinks. <laughs> I do love my pinks. Look at that. Look at this little tag. And then this is... This is Rosemary. You rock. Yeah, look at that with a guitar. Look at that. Thank you so much. I love it all. It was such a happy surprise. So I have been dragging my behind all week. I'm just between mom and worrying about her and running back and forth all day taking care of her and staying there at the house just to make sure she was okay. And then my allergies, and then the weather. We had terrible storms in Georgia last night. Our area was fine. We were on the very outer edge. We got some thunder and lightning and rain, but nothing, you know, horrible like tornadoes like so much of the country got, and some in our state. So I am very blessed, and thank, um, thank those of you who checked with me to make sure that I was doing all right. But I have been dragging, and I just am like, I told my mom today, I said, I want my energy to come back. I just need it to come back, because I have some crafting I want to do, and I just uh, haven't been able to, you know, to do it. So, um, I miss all of you, and hope that I will be back soon with some craftiness to show you. But those... Um, those pads of uh, mixed media paper at uh, Hobby Lobby were such a good deal. And I've seen a few other people hauling some now. They had mixed media, sketchbooks, um, watercolor paper, all different kinds of things. And um, I was just thrilled to get these couple of books that I, you know, pads that I did. So wishing you all a great weekend. I'll try to be back. I have decided that I cannot commit to Smile Saturday every week because my, um, my energy issues have just made me unreliable and I don't want to be unreliable. So if I can do it, I will. I'll be back. And if not, I will see you the next time. Thank you all so much. Thank you, Rosemary. I love it. Thank you. Bye now.